them let loose from the news that's kept me hanging around i'm just looking at the sky just to get me high forget the hurts cause i'll never die i got nine lives that says abusing everyone and even running wild cause i'm back yes i'm back Ooh, i'm back mama yes i'm back Ooh, i'm back hey 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 This is uh this is an instrumental segment of of the of the song that doesn't okay. When does he start singing again? When does he start singing again? Why would you leave the gaps in? I guess it makes sense. When does he start When does he start singing again? I'm skipping forward. There we go. There he is. enough thank you thank you brian johnson very cool <laughs> uh, i didn't want to get copyright claimed uh so i <laughs> yeah <laughs> so i just put the vocal track alone uh and apparently i think that works hold on let's put oh hell's bells drums only <laughs> lame i want his voice screaming hold on i have to snort also my girlfriend I, I, my girlfriend's here and she's gonna hear me snort because I'm muting the mic, but here, I'll just look her right in the eye when I do it. Thanks for that. <laughs> yeah, everybody say hi to Bella. Uh, we, I, I did my trip. I drove down to Michigan. I drove for 72 hours. And my body is broken. And, uh, and also kind of my brain a little bit. I think I broke my brain uh, somewhere along the way. Uh, but it was <laughs> power move. It was very, uh, it was very interesting, Michigan. The roads are terrible. I mean, I'll tell you all about it. Uh, but yeah, now Bella's, uh, Bella's living with me, which is pretty poggers in my opinion. Uh, and we're going to do, I'm going to hop right back in with, with some sack daily. This is some great art. This is by Mattress who, er, right? Yeah, Mattress. Who's really been out doing themselves lately? Uh, oh, excuse me. I'm a little under the weather. I think I picked up some kind of little bug or something. My sinuses are a little fucked up, so I'm gonna try not to be too snorty. But this is a reference to uh ah. Sorry, I had to snort again. Uh, this is a reference to when I streamed Dark Souls. It was like my spellcaster run. It was the last stream of it, and I made this, like, weird art that was me, like, crushing souls over and over again, uh, because I was doing the soul dupe glitch. And this time it's with Isaac with dailies. It's really good. Uh, so thank you, Mattress. The very specific reference, but, uh, well done. Yup, that's Michigan. Yeah, it was funny, like, the instant I crossed over the state line into Michigan... It was just, like, all of a sudden, the roads were terrible, and everybody drives like an asshole. It was, uh, pretty cool. So, yeah, I'm, I am gonna just ease into it with a little bit of sack, though. 
You guys know that I like the sack. Uh, we're gonna do a daily. Today's daily is an Apollyon daily. Isaac and his mother. <clears throat> uh, Apollyon is not the most fun character, but we'll see if we can make it work. Bella is also playing the daily. She was like, I bet, I bet our runs will go for the exact same amount of time. Because I definitely don't take way too goddamn long. Okay. Gotta get back into the swing of things. I have not played Isaac in ages. I.e. like two weeks. Uh, that is a room I do not recognize. Starting off strong. Uh, Bogo Moms is also a good indicator. Uh, so let me know if the sound and everything is alright. When I got home, like, every single thing on my stream, uh, every piece of streaming software had to update. So, I'm almost anticipating something going wrong. But so far, it seems to be good. Okay, we're just gonna leave that there. Uh, we're going all the way down to the first major boss of the game here. Ow! Uh, I mean, this guy could end my run very quickly. I did not intend to get hit by that bomb. It just sort of happened. Ah. Why is this danger? Okay. Good. I didn't mean to do that, but whatever, that's fine. Uh. I agree that they should update dailies. Oh, I'll take that. Uh. Yeah, get rid of the mom goal. Get rid of... Put in tainted characters. Why can't I play as tainted characters? This is bullshit. One second. Sorry. Sorry, Bella. <laughs> you get to hear every single one of those. Okay. <laughs> uh... Okay... <clears throat> no spoilers for new players. Yeah, like, uh, like Mega Satan. I say fuck him. It's also got every item unlocked. You can get goddamn death certificate here. Screw the new players. <laughs> so yeah, my, my whole body hurts. Particularly my shoulder. Health down! Yeah! Bella, why did you not warn me about the health down pill? I was actually gonna scream. Oh, <laughs> when I opted that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get back seated. Or not really. Goddamn health down. Okay. Like, I don't know. I think they should add the extra bosses. Because screw it. Because when you first boot up the game, the only end boss is just Mom. Like, technically every other boss is a spoiler boss to a certain degree. And I think part of the... Uh, almost part of the good part of the dailies is that people who don't have everything unlocked can see what type of stuff they're missing out on. And, like, you can play as Keeper and shit. Actually, can you? You can play as the Lost on these. Uh... Mine's twelve. Uh, here's something that just came to mind. I have many things to say about my trip, but... I learned Michigan City... is not in Michigan. It's in, like, Indiana. Which is fucking dumb. Why? Also, it's apparently a horrible, horrible place to live. Uh, but I went to Galloping Ghost, uh, you may have noticed I did not stream that. It was very cool, but I didn't stream it, uh, just cause, I don't know. We were just focusing on driving home, and I didn't buy a GoPro. And, yeah, we did not, we did not stay for long. Guess I'm just gonna get that, there's not been much to Zorb this run. Hmm. If there's a curse room, I'm gonna do it and just get rid of this gold heart, cause... Gold hearts kind of annoy me. Because it's like, just give, give me the money. You know? Uh, 
<laughs> is this possible? Okay, whatever. We'll never know. <laughs> mm. If I can get that backpack, I will, because one of the drawbacks of Apollyon is having a spacebar item right from the start. Why was that... Is it... Like, I know I beat a mini-boss in here, but... Is it supposed to play this music? Huh. Uh, I got two speeding tickets. I've never gotten a speeding ticket before this trip, but I got two. One of them was pretty reasonable. The other one was for going 10 above the speed limit, which, like, yeah... It was the speed limit was 70, and I was going 80. Uh, like, fuck me, right? Uh, you know, a lesser man would zorb this. But this is, this is Grapefruit Streams. I'm gonna get a huge BOGO Bombs bonus. <clears throat> and, I mean, that coin is not enough to push us over to seven, but if we find... No. Hmm. Let's go in here. It's flies. There you go. Now we get that. We get the backpack. I'm glad it was on sale. So, see what I mean about the golden hearts? Just give me the fucking money. I've often complained about soul hearts that they, uh. They don't really do. They, they don't add any complexity to the game. There's almost no way to game the system with, uh, with gold hearts. Like, they just don't add a lot. Okay. Um. God, we have to deal with fucking curses. We've got two in a row, too. Uh, is this... Oh, it is hard mode. Look at that. There's the blood splatter. Somebody pointed out a few streams ago, or a few dailies ago, that you can get hard mode in, uh, on dailies. Which, I guess it's just uncommon. Damn it. I wanted to just, like, send in a bomb as a sleeper agent. Whatever, we're picking these up now. Uh, but... Gold hearts just barely do anything, and, like... I guess gold pennies also barely do anything. Whatever. Gold pennies have some complexity. They can be a bit of a pain in the ass sometimes. But at least that's something. Gold hearts are just a little annoying. Uh, so yeah, I, I gotta pay two speeding tickets now, though, which is fun. Uh, one, of the, one of the policemen who pulled me over had, like, a comedy Minnesota accent. It was right in the city of Fargo, which, you know, I would think is hilarious, because Fargo, you know, but it's less hilarious because I have to pay $135 times two. The other ticket was more reasonable, though. I was going 100 miles an hour in a 75 zone. Like, yeah, that's, you know, yeah, that's a ticket. I Like, I'll take that. That's whatever. Like, I maybe even deserve that. What did you say? I'm gonna let you know this one for your own sanity. Don't take the white pill, it's amnesia. The white pill is amnesia. Okay, thank you, babe. <laughs> <laughs> She's not gonna let me get white pilled. Hmm. Okay. I'll take that. Uh, so, yeah. Galloping Ghost was cool, though. They had Primal Rage 2 and Tattoo Assassins, which are both unreleased games. We never actually streamed Primal Rage 2, but we streamed... Lark and I did Primal Rage 1 and Tattoo Assassins. Uh... Which was very cool to see. And they had, like, a shmup, like, bullet hell section. They had a huge, just, like, row of Street Fighter games. Just, like, the whole series, basically. Uh, what did you say? Yeah, Holiseum. There were some weird gimmicky ones. Yeah, oh shit. Aw, oh, that was dumb of me. Whatever. Uh, 
yeah, I really liked seeing all the crazy... There's just some weird gimmick machines that I, I never even knew existed. Let's just pick this up, because that's going to go to the Red Heart. Uh, if they're unreleased, how do they have them? Uh, a lot of arcade games would get, like, sent out... Oh, is that... What hit me? Okay, maybe the f fire shot? So, whatever. Uh, they send them out to test locations. So, remember when I played... Sega Sonic Bros, which was the Falling Tile Sonic game. I'm going to ignore this. Uh, that was one that was unreleased, and nobody has ever actually found a cabinet of that. But they did release it. They, they did let people play test it to see how they would like it, and people didn't like it, and that's why it's unreleased. So I assume similar things happened with Tattoo Assassins. But it's basically just a rare collective or collector's item. Uh... Hmm. Hmm. Not great. Whatever. It's not the white pill. We can rule out the idea that it's amnesia. Um, I'm gonna go in here because I don't really care about my soul hearts. Thankfully, the health down doesn't matter because I got a fuck ton of health anyway. Now, I know this is gonna upset people, but Zorb. <laughs> Ooh, damage. Nice. Uh, and where did we check for secret room? We checked, like, down from here, I think. Let's try right here. Actually, am I wrong? I might be wrong. No, it's in the room with the gold chest, so... I did not check this wall, and it's probably here. In all honesty. I also got addicted to this YouTube channel called Ordinary Sausage where this dude, and some of you are probably already familiar with his works this dude just like makes anything into a sausage and he's got like professional sausage making equipment and he just and he just rolls it up into a sausage and he, it's, it's beautiful to watch the first video that I saw, I did not- Bella just, like, showed it to me and did not tell me what it was. And it was just a- it was just him cramming the, like, Taco Bell Mexican pizza into a meat grinder and then making an actual decent-looking sausage out of- oh, oh, oh! That bomb beggar was pretty cool. Uh, he did not- <laughs> he did not give me money though, although I don't need money. Sharp plug is nothing. I just I just want that I want a key. Shop doesn't even have a key though, so whatever. Whatever. But the guy has a really funny voice. He he it's I'm trying to think it it, it almost sounds like the like what Mike Stoklasa, his like weird old person voice that he does sometimes. But it's really hard to describe what's amazing about the Sausage Channel. You just—you really just gotta check it out. Uh, would definitely recommend. What a guy. He has all these little weird traditions, like when he when he packs the sausage with his like sausage machine. There's like a little bit of like stuff left over in the tube, and he does like a blow test where he blows it out onto a picture of Mark Ruffalo. I don't know why it's a picture of Mark Ruffalo. I think it's like a pun on like hitting the mark, I guess. But uh what? There's no choke, there is no bit. Uh god damn it. Why did Not only did that heart spawn there, I think that pill spawned there because I was standing in the center. Thankfully that's the white pill, which is the amnesia one. Uh And and not only does he rate the quality of the sausage, but he rates how well the stuff blows out of the tube onto a picture of Mark Ruffalo. Uh, oh. Bop, bop, bop. Okay. Oh, Breath of Life. Poggers. I can, I can carry it. I have two, like, weird swirly items now. You know what? Yeah. Damn, sad bombs don't fuck around. Or was that, like, an explosivo that somehow... No. No, that was sad bombs. 
good shit set bombs. Yeah, Explosiva was the move here. Uh, so, who else has, like, barely ever used this item? Because it's so bad. To my memory, it literally doesn't work. Like, it purports to make you invincible while you're holding down the button, but but it doesn't. It just doesn't do that. Does anybody know what's up with this item? Does anybody know how to use this item? Or is it literally just, like, it, impossible to use? Like... Oh, wait, this is a Tinty. A cleverly hidden Tinty. Like, is there a single person among us who knows? Of what, what you do with Breath of Life. It's only w when it reaches... Invincible for like half a second while the charge reaches zero. Are you fucking kidding me? Why is it like that? Oh my god. Oh, and then it hurts you. <laughs> what the fuck? Why? Why would they make it like that? Why would they make it like that? This is a terrible, terrible item. I love how it's like universally accepted that it's bad. They, like, they need to patch that. Like, there, there has to be a better way to do this. Eh. Like, this is just here to taint the pool of, of Angel Spacebar items when you're playing as Tainted Eden. Oh, yeah. Uh. Thing is, if I void it, I think it's completely useless. Ugh. And then Zorbing the Doctor's Remote is also not great. I'm just gonna take Doctor's Remote over it. I'm glad I got the, uh, the bag. But yeah, so I'm kind of obsessed with this dude making sausage out of, like, anything. He did, like, all the elements. Like, he made a fire sausage, which he cheated and just used fireball. But then he actually made a dirt sausage. And, uh, a water sausage and an air sausage. He made a sausage out of air. And, like, managed to- I, I'm pretty sure he managed to sear it somehow. Which is impressive. One of my favorites was when he made a sausage out of sausage casings. And he was like, it's like chewing on an ear. It was just a bunch of like weird gummy stuff. I think it's like animal intestine that you wrap a sausage in. <laughs> so yeah, pork intestine. Really weird stuff, but every once in a while, it, it's also interesting to watch because there's an amount of tension to it. Because sometimes an unexpected ingredient will actually make a good sausage. Like, uh, I think like aloe vera ended up being a decent sausage, or maybe it was cactus. Okay, I'm absorbing this. Uh, but planetarium- Babe, do you get a planetarium? I'm gonna be honest, I'm doing terrible this run. <laughs> I am- Okay. Oh, I did pick that up. Okay, we're gonna absorb it. DAMAGE! You get a fun card from it. Uh... You get the card against... Oh, the poop card. Here's a... <sighs> Fuck! Oh well. I don't know if it's that accurate. Yeah, I don't know. It, it might depend on what room you do it in or something. <laughs> oh, we gotta go to the library. But yeah, big recommend on Ordinary Sausage. Okay, this is good. These are both great things to Zorb. And we're gonna pick these up for counts toward the bookworm transformation. Get our money back on that key. And I'm just gonna keep Doctor's Remote. That angel item can just sit there. It can just fucking sit there. Uh. Oh, but I don't have, uh, I don't have charge for this. It's a good thing there's a battery. Oh, okay. White pill. That's amnesia. Double f horse pill pheromones. Okay. Well, I have to bring this with and see what it does. 
Because most horse pills have some kind of crazy effect. And I have not seen all of them. It might be like Tarot Cloth, where some of them don't do anything super special, but... Horse pheromones. Hey, don't say that, chat. Thanks. None of that. Please don't say that. Uh... Okay, yeah, we're gonna do the big suck. That's pretty cool. And, uh... What was in the shop? Nothing? Bad? Uh, I could... Could get placebo and use horse pill pheromones. Uh, no. But yeah, I will never look at a sausage the same way again. He made one with, like, Carolina Reaper. And even as it was cooking, he was like, I'm blind! My fingers don't work anymore! <laughs> it's, it's partially just the fact that he's a really funny guy, genuinely. He has such a way with words. And I just love watching him blow meat out of a tube, what can I say? Uh, okay, let's use the horse pheromones, as chat has so eloquently put it. Okay, oh, neat! It, like, perma-charms the enemies in the entire room, that's awesome. I love horse pills. I wish Tarot Cloth went this hard with doubling card effects, but it does not. And it's kinda lame for it. So, uh, you know... Placeboing that would have been pretty cool, but whatever. Too late now. Uh, you know, against my best judgment, I'm already on Catacombs 2, and, uh, like, we're most of the way through the run. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But I guess it makes sense, because, like, Tarot Cloth, if it truly did, like, wacky shit like horse pills do, for every single card, it, it would probably be a pretty broken item. Alright. This, this is feeling like a one run. Uh, I, you know, never thought I'd say this, but Void actually gave us a lot of good damage. Mm, yeah. Yeah. It's only gonna give us the map for two floors, but I do like having the map. And we're gonna bomb this guy, cause why not? Let's see if we can get- hold on. Blow up the- no, okay. I wanted to see if I could blow up the confessional. Uh, we're gonna get an angel room item out of this. Okay, never mind. Goodbye. I should've- oh, it's a diaper. Cool. Uh... I should've used doctor's remote. It's an amateur move. Uh, Gonna absorb that. It gave me a coin. Why did it give me a coin? Oh, right. Wow, I have exactly 10 damage. It's because I absorbed the Book of Sin. Uh, should have used Doctor's Remote for that too, whatever. Boom. Uh -huh. Pretty fly. Damn it. Amnesia. This is the white pill with little spots on it. I should have taken the white, white pill. Okay, well, we're gonna... Now that I got the map, we're gonna take two amnesia pills. And... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what the fuck? Why is it like that? Okay. So, what do we got? It's bad, it's bad. Oh, uh, but yeah, I mean, what else? Uh, I got hooked on Popeyes. I've been shown the light of Popeyes and the amazing chicken sandwiches. Uh, I just never knew. I simply never knew. There's not one, like, near my house. So I was never... I was never tempted with Popeyes. I always, for some reason, thought it was, like, exclusively seafood. Because, like, Popeye the Sailor Man? 
uh, that's my only that's my only attempt at logic there. I really really have no one to blame but myself. But anyway, I would recommend. Ah, very good. Really, the main thing is I'm bitter about getting two speeding tickets in one day. But, like, ugh. Also, North Dakota, worst state. There are no... Th th no worse states than North Dakota. I should have taken... You know, I knew what I was getting into when I took that pill. What I was potentially getting into. I should have taken note of where the secret rooms were. But I just straight up didn't. I did not. So this is this is my burden to bear. Uh Let's see if Doctor's Remote works for this. I think it does. Yeah. Binky. Very nice. I was just looking to get a red heart before I pick up that that half, that mixed soul heart thing. Very cool room. I did why did I even go in here? I'm an idiot. Should have taken care to see if there were actually, you know, doors in the room. What a terrible room. Okay. Now, uh... I mean, this is in the bag. I, do we, I don't even need to care. Should have tried to go for boss rush. Because I think, even on a mom run, you can still get the boss rush before picking up the trophy. Which can be kind of neat. That's the nails. What was in here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, we already got the normal secret room. And I bet the super secret is... Oh, God. It's actually in a weird spot. Mm, I'm going to try right here, and then I'm going to leave. It's harder to do without the map. Oh, oh, that's the secret room I already got. Well, that's a shortcut. Uh, I just don't even care. It might have goddamn rock bottom in it. I don't care. What else? Uh, let me talk about Galloping Ghost more. Uh, what else did they have? I mean, they had like everything. I was really excited to see they had Mushihime Sama, but. I'll yeah, oh yeah, they had the first Funky Fighter. Which I was really surprised to see. Because I feel like that's not like a particularly well-known game, but they had a lot of, like, you know, very niche things. A lot of games I had never heard of, of course. Uh, we went to a couple places that had Tapper. You guys know what? You guys know I like Tapper. And, uh... They had the game where he's a where, where the guy from Tapper is a lumberjack that I think came out before Tapper. I remember we 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 talked about this briefly when I streamed Tapper. Oh, what is this Ace of Hearts? I didn't even like realize I picked this up. Let's find a real juicy room to use this on. It's a juicy room. No. Uh, you know what? It's all annoying enemies, so I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay, yeah, having full map is just such a blessing. And it helps me, uh, a lot of the time... I don't know when to use items like Doctor's Remote, because I'm like, oh, I might need it. But here, I can rest assured, I can just use it and, uh... It doesn't really matter, because I I know... I know I'm not going to need it for a secret room anytime soon. Oh, yeah, and it also... I guess that room it especially doesn't matter, because it's a two-charge item, but, you know. I'm going to absorb that. Oh, my God! Void has been so good to me today. I think every single Zorb has given me damage. That's insane. God, Apollyon. Tainted Apollyon such a good character. Okay, let's just use world. Screw it. 
You just got two different cards that reveal the map when I have the item that permanently reveals the entire map, including secret rooms. Oh, that's a nice trinket. Another damage up. Oh. This is the one that you get for doing... It's one of the daily achievements. So I don't think I've ever actually seen this tro or this trinket in... Uh, in what we would call a standard Isaac run. But here it is here. I do have it unlocked, though. Oh my god. This damage is amazing. For a mom run, this is pretty good. <laughs> so just doctors from just use. Blow up a skull. Get chaos card. Question marks profit. Uh, yeah, we don't care. Very good, very good. Bella's been obsessed with this game Scratchin' Melody that got a demo recently. It has four actual, like, songs in it, and we've listened to them many, many, many times. <laughs> to, to the point of exhaustion at times. But, <laughs> but, no, they're good. It's a cool game. And the songs are bangers. Uh, can't wait till they release the full game. I'll probably play it on stream. If I had to guess. I was thinking about streaming the demo. Oh, and also Shovel Knight Dig. I, I might actually... Fuck, I should have done that today, honestly. I was thinking about streaming that. Health down. This is depths one. We're just gonna bop. Uh-oh. I'm really glad he didn't jump. A lot of the time, monstro type guys can uh can can just screw you with their jumps. Uh I'll also probably try out Trombone Champ for a bit, just just for the joke, because I did play Trombone in band. Uh, bad Angel Room lock here. And we don't have any familiars, so I'm just gonna absorb this man. ANOTHER DAMAGE! <laughs> what is up with that? Why do I keep getting damage from Void? Is, is the game glitched? I think- I think the game broke. Uh, this is Greed Fight. I really hope there's a good shop on the next floor. And I'm going to slam my gunt into the curse room door. I really love how that Ace of Hearts gave me 100% half red hearts. The absolute worst possible drops from that. And uh, yeah, another one! Yeah! Okay, let's go fight. I wish there was a blood dono. Uh, at, at Bella's house, there were also like a million pets. Because her mom fosters animals. There were cute bunnies. There, uh, there was there was a rabbit that is the biggest rabbit I've ever seen in my life. There was a bird that I'm pretty sure wanted me dead. Like it wanted to kill me just straight up. Like, every time I walked past the cage, it would, like, gnaw at the bars of the cage. <laughs> uh... So, yeah. Oh, and there were three... Oh, God, there were these three dogs. And one of them... I wish I could show you. I guess I'd, I... I might have a video at some... somewhere, but... There's this one dog that just had something, like, broken in its brain. That it just kept, like, spinning around. Over and over again. Uh, is this even worth taking? No, the answer is no. It just... Actually... That works on devil deals, doesn't it? No, who cares? This is the second to last floor. There was this, th this dog that just would not stop rotating at any given moment. It was like, instead of its idle animation, was just spinning around. And, and they're little tiny Pomeranians that had these little dumb faces. And they were so cute. And they were so stupid. And the other- there was another one that was like a foot freak, too. It- that like, whenever- whenever I had my shoes off, it just- it just goes for your toes, and just like slurps on them. 
It was very distressing, actually. <laughs> I don't, I don't like, I don't, I don't like that sensation. And the dog, dog did not get the message that I did not want to have my toes licked constantly and repeatedly. Oh, good, cool troll bomb, yeah. Uh, so yeah, I, I learned very quickly to like not enter the house without without putting on shoes. And it's like, even if you wear, like, shorts, they'll just lick your, like, shins instead. It just wants some of that action. Uh... This doesn't actually get rid of Devil D- Oh, okay. Double Mom? I don't even know if that works with Mom, but we're gonna see. I've rarely ever interacted with Vanishing Twin. I don't even care about this room. <laughs> There. Okay, there goes the chance, but it doesn't matter. Because after the boss is dead, the run is over. And it is at least relaxing to know that Greed will not be in the shop. He will be in the secret room. Because that's how Greed works. And I don't know how I went so long without knowing the Greed mechanics. But that is a thing. I mean, it's not exactly obvious, I guess. Um, we'll juice that guy later. I see a tenty. Wet sausage. I can't stop saying that. Every time he makes a sausage, he does this weird little hand gesture that I don't know what it's supposed to represent. It does not resemble any part of the sausage-making process. He just sort of does it. I did, yeah, I, I guess you guys can't see. Also, another Tinty. Just, like, what a great channel, though. What a guy. Love him. He, he's just so good at what he does. It's also amazing hearing him be, like, openly spiteful about, like, the joke requests that he gets. Like, making a sausage out of dirt. He just openly hates the people that request shit like that. But he does it! He does it anyway, because he's a legend. Oh. Okay, well, you know, we got cool damage. We've got really amazing shot speed. But, uh, not a whole lot of health. I'm glad I have the sun card. And I guess I should pop, uh, void when I go into the boss room. I kind of forgot that I had, like, book of homing shots and shit like that. Oh, and actually, we're gonna get to see the really cool Aquarius homing shots synergy. Where you get homing creep. Okay. Oh, we got a reroll machine. That's cool. Hmm. Well. No. Oh. I'm just gonna buy that. And then we're gonna see if we can just dupe. Uh, I, I guess I could get kid named Magic Finger. <laughs> Let's just buy it. I might just like go into the mom fight and just mash. Uh, lame. <clears throat> King Baby? No, too late for that. Uh. I guess I could have duped it and got two counts toward conjoined. Damn. Uh, okay, give me the give me the remote. Blow up those assholes. Absolutely nothing. Very cool. Uh, cannot absorb diplopia. Sadly, that's not a thing. And. Yeah, I think so. I don't think it doubles... I don't know, actually. That's an interesting <laughs> question. Uh... Hmm... I mean, it's not like we're gonna get a better use out of this Diplopia. Yeah, whatever. Let's just do that. Because then... It'll also pick up... I'm trying to, like, do the math in my head here. Yeah, 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 yeah. We get a Soul Heart. We get another Amnesia Pill, which is pretty pogged out. 
world, okay? Yeah, uh, you know what? Yes. Let's pick up one kid named Magic Finger. And I'm not even gonna pick up the jumper cables, we're just gonna absorb all this. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, we'll see if we get double bomb from that. Uh huh. Okay. Now, oh, do we have enough? We might not have. I guess I'll maybe do the boss challenge room. I really want to. Maybe is it battery? No, I don't think there is. I guess the jumper cables might come in clutch if I buy them, which I have not bought them. Okay. Because we, we ideally, when you do a mom daily, you, you want to stomp mom. You want to just absolutely destroy the fight. Instead of her stomping you. Uh. I think, uh, you know, even if we don't get charged before the fight, we might get it during the fight from Jumper Cables. She spawns goons. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Uh, I have not been counting the amount of enemies, so we'll just see. I think it's every 15 enemies. If memory serves. Damn it. Okay, well, you know what? tell you what I'm gonna do. We're gonna go juice the boy. I'm gonna use sun card. And then, and this is a big brain play, we're gonna kill the devil beggar if we don't get any payout from him. He's gonna drop enemies to kill and it'll charge the item for me. Oh yeah. He's probably gonna pay out though. We can do it with rotten beggar. Oh! Okay, uh-huh. Uh. That's actually kind of lame. Uh, okay. Give me this. And I guess I shouldn't spend too much money because we want a kid named Magic Finger this. Okay, yeah, screw this guy. We're gonna bomb it. Nothing. Doesn't he normally drop little grubs? God damn it. <clears throat> okay. Oh, I could have been juicing on this, too. Why do we keep getting the double hearts off the- Woo! I guess I also have... You know, I- For some reason, I thought I had fanny pack and that I was just getting lucky, but no, it's just old bandage. This is just standard old bandage play. Okay. This is good juice. Maybe I should, uh, ah. Uh, yeah, live a little. Let's live a little. Let's go do the boss challenge room, because I'm an asshole. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well. That's a mixture of fortunate and unfortunate. This guy can give you spiders. If you get the wrong thing from him, and he gives you spiders, and then you kill it, and then you get charged. It'll work. It'll work. Oh god, now he's never gonna not pay out, though. Okay. Hope it doesn't matter if I kill them or if my spiders kill them. Here's the, w here's the way I find to waste time on this run. Finally, we found it. I was gonna be so pissed if I got Skatol there. Okay, yes! Big brain! Big brain. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna pick that. Oh, oh no! It will be. It will genuinely be here forever. That's how you know it's intense when I pass up the like time-wasting strat. Good God, because then you know I'm gonna get Skatol. Uh, this shop, whatever. That was a world card or something. World star! Okay. Boys and girls. Now. We are in it. I'm gonna pop the sun too, because that does a little bit of damage to mom. Ow! I don't know if it launched two things. Alright, now kidney match figure. <laughs> yeah, boy. And what do we got? 
Okay. Well, it was a boring mom daily. What do you know? Uh, I'm probably gonna just do another run after this. Just because that was 50 minutes, at it, you know? It's honestly a pretty svelte, uh... Oh, there was a coin in the trophy. Pretty svelte daily by my standards. All things considered. What did I get? Top 500. Yay. That's... That's something. Let's look at the, uh... Oh, my god. Wow. I got better than you. You owe me five dollars. That's not... <laughs> no. <laughs> but the two guys that are, like, way better at the game than me... ...died, I believe? Which is why their scores are red. Yeah, I won, but I didn't get, like, any yeah. items. Huh. Neat. Uh, that was really boring. This is what I get for having faith in, uh... ...in, in Apollyon Void. Void red pilling has occurred. Uh, okay, what, what, are we, what, what are we gonna do here? Should we do... What? What are you giggling about? Get me in there. <laughs> no, yeah, uh, another time, another time. We'll do, we'll do, we'll do some more co-op at some point. Uh, you know, I'm feeling the poop stinker. Like, uh, I'm getting requests for Tainted Keeper. I did Tainted Keeper last time, because Tainted Keeper is, is so fun. Let's do Poopastinka. I like Poopastinka, and you know what? For the extra added challenge, I'm going to do Greedier Mode, which only an insane man would, uh, would willingly do Greedier Mode after getting all the unlocks. Okay, what do we got? Oh! Ace of Diamonds is very cool. The sun is basically useless. Oh, you know, I should, uh, turn mods back on. Hold on. Boop! Wait, I've been playing through Omori. Bella has been showing me Omori. And, uh, it's a very good game. I was thinking about... I'm, I'm like a third of the way through the game or something, and I was thinking about just... starting streaming it and not acknowledging the fact that I'm, like, partway through the game and just letting people go insane over that. Uh... <laughs> just, like, calling the VOD, like, part three or something like that. Just being like, oh yeah, welcome back to my Omori playthrough. Yik ripoff. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, damn it. Damn it, that was a really good start. And I fucked it up by turning mods off, whatever, or on. Damn it. But I don't think I'm gonna do that. Uh, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna keep enjoying the game off stream. Uh, but it's very good. It's got a banger soundtrack. Hey, poop! God, the pog with his mouth full of shit is so disgusting. <laughs> okay. Tainted Blue Baby starts out with bad stats, so Tears Up is great. Oh my god. Demonic shopkeep. Actually, is that from something? I like, vaguely recognize that dude. Uh, the main difficulty with this character is that your soul hearts only, and also you don't really get normal bombs. Oh, this makes creep. Interesting. I never really realized that. This is a very complicated character, and uh, I kind of love this character to a degree. Uh, just because it's so, so weird, completely changes the way you play the game. <clears throat> uh, I don't know, I mean, I could continue the dumb, like, tutorial bit, but I feel like a lot of people would actually really benefit from, uh... And it wasn't even a bit. But, uh... A lot of people could really benefit from learning how the fuck this character works. Because it's pretty complicated, but basically I got these poops. When I pick up a poop item... You, you see that there, there's like a, a set order. It's not a set order, but it's like, it's random, but you can see what poops are coming next. Those are the ones that are like faded out in that little menu. And, uh... Each little poop item does a different thing. This one, for instance, just makes, makes stinka clouds. A, a mixture of the stinka clouds that poison and the ones that blow up. But this one can be useful just walking around with it, because you just poison enemies. Although you can't shoot tears, but it's it's kind of nice. And then when you put it down, it just makes a big stinky cloud. 
Uh, these ones with the flies, it's useful to put these in the corner of a room, because then they spawn three flies around them that'll help you. But the flies, I believe, only attack enemies that you are currently attacking with your tears. Uh, which means you can't use it to just cheese things, which is... that's reasonable. It'll be an amazing, like, godlike, uh, nod leaf synergy. Otherwise. Uh, so yeah. Oh, and there's three different kinds of poop pickups. These are the singular poops. There's, like, double poops and triple poops, too. Uh, and the poops will disappear when I leave the room. Uh, and you also get this little jar. Uh, I, I'm not a Tetris player, but I've heard from people who play, like, competitive Tetris that a lot of Tetris games have this similar thing where you can hold on to a piece. Uh, in this case, it's a piece of poop. Uh, normal poops are just normal. Wow. Duke of Flies just got wrecked by that. Jesus Christ. Stone poops are kind of complicated, but they basically just, uh... At, at, the, at the lowest level, they just block shots and take a lot of hits to destroy. Uh, but you really... A lot of the time, you want to hold on to the bomb ones, which is why I have a bomb one inside... A butt bomb inside my hold jar. Uh, but... Poopa Stink is really good in greed mode, too, because you can just sort of set up camp. Uh, with these, like, fly poops and stuff, and have them benefit you the entire time. Oh, and you keep the flies when you leave the room, too, so I will have... Only three, actually? Weird, I thought I would have six. Uh... Mon Mondo Baby's actually... Or Mongo Baby's actually pretty good. I'm gonna take the D6. I feel that will be a worthwhile investment for later. Uh, now what do we got here? Oh, perfect opportunity to use that. Oh, oh, way better, way goddamn better. I don't know why I like held off on picking up that soul heart. Uh, okay. Now, I guess we're just gonna go. This is the demon phase. So yeah, quad shot is pretty cool, I guess. And we got so many bombs. I, it's really hard to hit pin with bombs. I don't know why I did that. But uh, we're gonna. I'm, I'm gonna try to tutorial a few more of these poops because some of them are really useful and really like complicated. Does Tainted Blue Baby get the same? Thing where double deals cost one soul heart. No, they do not. Cool. Well, that's neat. I'm not taking any of those. Uh, so, this is a flaming poop. Here's a little use of flaming poops. They can destroy shopkeeps. Get you a little bit of dosh. And otherwise, they just leave a little fire on the ground when they're destroyed that hurts enemies and does not hurt you. Uh, then... Oh man, I almost, I, I just wasted it. But this one that I have here is just a fart. It just creates a cloud of gas that can be blown up. Uh, so I'm gonna, you know, you could use the fire poop to do that and sort of construct a bomb. Fucking PJs was in there, okay. Uh, but if you don't have a bomb poop, you can use the fart ones and a fire one to sort of like MacGyver together a, a usable bomb. Okay, that was pretty bad, but whatever. Now, do we want anything from here? Uh, you know... Kinda want the safety scissors, although it's not really gonna help as much on greed mode. And also, I wonder if it would turn them into... Because bombs don't spawn for this character. Uh, it, and if you're in co-op, bombs can spawn, but even if you try to pick them up, they don't actually do anything, because you don't have a place to hold them. I need to blow my nose. Okay. Uh, now... Yeah, I don't think I want to pick that up, because I don't think those would actually benefit me. And here's something. I'm just gonna... So this poop, this little brown droplet that I have... That is, like, the best one 
Uh, it's a creep that goes on the floor and boosts your damage. That's the short version. I'm going to hold on to that. And I guess... With this bomb... Because when there's a bunch of poop pickups just lying around, I kind of want to just use them up. So I'm just going to check for a secret room with that. It was not a secret room. I think most of the normal poops can have items in them. It's like at a pretty low rate, though. Okay, uh, we're, we, we got a good thing going here. Let's just go. So yeah, this character, I've heard a lot of people complain about this character being like really difficult, and I definitely felt that at first when playing this character, but uh, the more you get the hang of it... Oh, I should have re-rolled that. Whatever. It's a luck up, I guess. Uh, once you like learn what's going on, then it's a lot better. And like I said, in greed mode, it can even feel kind of OP. Okay, Toothpicks is of course very cool. D100 is of course funny. <clears throat> and, hmm. Let's see what's in here. Uh, I'm gonna take that. We just got the luck up. I'm gonna commit to the bit. Because quad shot shooting out the back of me is actually a... Oh, no, it's just a single tier. Great. Oh, that's kind of poop. Whatever. So, we're going to use the creep here. Uh, I find it beneficial to just do this. Just smear it like that. And then I'm going to smear it like this. And them being connected is important. Because this creep has a weird property where if you put other poops on top of it, it, like, absorbs the properties of those poops. So... The stone poop is very specific to, and this is hard to describe. Let me, uh, let me, let me keep setting up shop here. So if I put the flaming poop onto this creep, the creep will turn red, and it gives me fire shots, for instance. Uh, which can be, you know, kind of dangerous, but whatever. But the stone poop, normally if I were to destroy the red poop, it would turn the creep back into normal creep that just gives me a damage up and a tears up. Uh, but since the stone poop is on there, it like absorbs the effect of the red poop. So now, great. Now if I destroy the red poop, the creep remains red, which can be very useful. And so that's like the main use of stone poops, basically. Uh, so now, uh, we're not going to get any of these. Oh yeah. And I just wasted that too. Okay. Whatever. It's fine. Ow. But yeah, that's that's like the long and short of like how the creep works. It's it's something that I feel you would never figure out on your own. <laughs> like I, I don't I certainly had to look it up. Cuz when I was playing this character, I was like this character fucking sucks. And people were like, "Oh, they they're actually quite good. You just need to uh, learn how all the poop effects work." Probably gonna die here, actually. We'll see. Let's see if I can pull a victory out of my ass. Lamau, this is a poop character. Lamau. Bonk. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap that. Um. It's fine. We got two more creeps in a row. That might might go to waste, but you know. It's fine. But the creep the creep is really the main that's this character's real claim to fame. Oh yeah, and the poops The poops come out of uh Tainted Blue Baby and enemies, I think. And uh there's a misconception that goes around that Painted Blue Baby will just randomly fart out a, a gas cloud that will blow you up. Not actually true. Uh, it's just people use the, uh, the, the the fart poop and don't realize. Man, what a great game, letting us say sentences like this. So, I'm, I'm considering using the crane game, like if I get... It's relying on like a lot of luck, though is the thing. Let's do it. We're committing to the bit. 
Can I get one more? No. Okay, well that was bad. Ah, uh, Eraser. Okay, well I guess... Uh, hmm. We're not even gonna get enough to, uh... To recharge the D6 too, that sucks. Okay, well I'm gonna try my best. We're gonna attempt to win here. And I'm gonna keep the eraser, cause screw it. Uh... And now... Ho! Oh. But yeah, that like, effect... That like, transitory... Effect of, of like, the poops is why I, I keep the, the creep streaks connected. Like that. And there's a very rare holy poop that you can get, that if you put that on the creep, it becomes amazing. It's just now struck me that it's it's weird that these guys have just normal bombs. Oh, and not troll bombs. I, I can't think of another enemy that just shoots normal bombs. Maybe there are. Uh... Hold over from Flash Isaac, I guess. Yeah, we're gonna go for it. We are, in fact, gonna go for it. In fact, what does uh, what does the black poop do in this situation? Like, how does that affect my shots? Okay. The main ones are the fire, the, the like green poop, and the holy poop. Those are the ones you want to use. Let's see. Uh, damn it. I know that shit works on Delirium. Actually, I think that was specifically the Eraser Wisp. But whatever, we want the money from this guy anyway. It's actually quite fortuitous if I can survive, which I probably will be able to. Oh! Yeah. Nice. Look at that. That's hot. And see, the, the creep remains black, even though I destroyed the meconium poop. Okay, well, you know, I kind of, uh... I, 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 I really, really made the best of that situation. I'm happy about that. Oh. Oh. Hello? I mean, yeah. I wonder if that works. Speaking of the holy poop... I'm I'm wondering if this actually will will be functional. I, like I wonder if that synergizes. We'll see. Ow. Uh No, it's like a different holy poop though. Oh, and I have the like eye in the back of your head which is going to fuck it up a lot. Whatever. Oh no. Uh what just negated damage? Oh, I guess the holy poop does that, right? Ow. Oh, I'm gonna die. E. Oh. Oh. Why'd I do that? Why did I do this? Why do any of us do anything? You know what? Smear the creep. Ow. I died. I'm- you know what? I'm kinda sad, because I'm curious to see if that would've worked. Because it's a- it's a- it is a holy poop, but it's a different holy poop. It's like a different kind. I should have just tried smearing the, uh, smearing the creep underneath it. Something tells me it doesn't work, though. For whatever reason. <laughs> okay, uh... There's not really a reason not to take this. It's like the off chance there's something I could get that would, uh... Reroll it, but no. Um. Okay. We don't even have enough to get the key, sadly, and don't have. Or I guess we do have the makings of a, a bomb. So we're gonna wrap it up here. And you want to be careful with this. Uh, a lot of the damage you take as this character will be hurting yourself with poops. There's a three poop, by the way. Um, oh, and there's a dime. There's a free dime. Very cool.
Now, that's neat. Okay, you know what? This is actually a pretty decent start. We're gonna just toss this in a corner where it's less likely to get damaged. Just gonna <laughs> waft these guys. Just gonna crop dust. That strat could only be called crop dusting. Also, the, the whole, like, bombs thing is a lot more important in normal mode, where bombs are a bit more of an asset. Here, they're just more to get, like, damage. Huh? Oh, ah. Sometimes the best way to deal with these angry fly enemies is just to, like, charge right at them, because they kind of circle around you. Uh, no creep at the moment. Just gonna bomb them. Ow. I almost want to, like, you know, go, like, open up the debug console or whatever and test if there's, uh... If there's a specific synergy between the, the tainted Poopa Stinka creep and Hallowed Ground. In fact, I, now that I'm really thinking about it, is is Hallowed Ground a different type of The ones that you get from Tainted Poopa Stinka are also holy. They they also have the little ring of light around them, right? I think I think it would have synergized. Oh look, there's a holy poop right there. So we're gonna wanna hang on to that. Uh, okay, pick these up, I'm gonna bomb, very cool, got lucky there, there's, oh wow, there's five spots in greed mode where secret rooms can show up, <laughs> got lucky and unlucky, okay, uh, gonna drop this here so this this gas poop will expand the radius of this bomb if I do this right which it's looking like I'm not gonna do it right nope it did it okay and we got an on sale item it's really what you want and we got the d10 the best item in the game yep can't fill that bone heart don't care yep yep and now we are just about at the tier cap. That's pretty cool. Uh, pick up these bad boys. The holy poop will put be put into the hold jar, because I don't think we're going to use that this floor. I guess I could. But really, you ideally want to use it to just destroy an entire greed mode floor. So we're just going to make do with... Uh, with what we got here. Okay. Hello, Ragman. I think... I think the poops that come out of you depend on how much damage you're doing, too, because I've noticed when you're absolutely melting an enemy, he just shits his goddamn brains out, like... I don't, I don't know the exact mechanics of that, honestly. Okay... You know, can you do plum flute strat on greed mode when it's not like or, or just when fruity plum shows up ever or little plum or whatever the hell its name is okay oh wow and the creep also does pretty massive damage to spiders wasn't that or was it a crab hit its weak point for massive damage whatever spiders are crab adjacent or no I think forget. Giant enemy crab and giant enemy spider are two different separate memes. Uh, I'm not gonna go in there because I've learned my lesson. I kind of want to use the rest of these poop pickups, but we also have some good ones in there. Okay, yeah, no, we're using these. It's just we already got the secret room, so it doesn't even matter. 
I guess I could have put the stinky in the middle and used this bomb on both to get both of these. I have no keys, too. I don't suppose I could, like, no. I was thinking maybe I'd, like, push it out of there. Uh, let's just bomb that. Very good. Let me go! Buy a key. Oh. That's a 1.7 tiers up. That's actually, we would be kind of wasting that because we're so near the tier cap. And it just gives you a damage down, too. Uh, I am going to get one of these. I kind of consider just not doing that. Excuse me for all the snorting. Hey, you know what? No harm, no foul. And we've now identified the health up pill. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Boop. Eh. Net loss of one coin. Which is why <laughs> I'm gonna keep using these poops. We're gonna kill this man. Uh. <clears throat> yeah, there is really, there is really nothing to even juice on this floor. Okay. Whatever. One of the biggest drawbacks of this character is uh, only being able to hold nine poops at once, and Birthright does give you 29 poop space, which I don't know why they don't just make it a clean 30, but whatever. Somebody, I think, attempted to explain why they don't make it a clean 30 at one point, and I like literally was too dumb to understand. Either that or it was a bad reason. <laughs> gonna do that some may some may see this as a hateful move uh so we got a couple things here we got the funny penny which is very funny uh i'm not gonna get the funny penny oh okay that's poggers. Oh my god, they're little blue baby C-sections. That's awesome. I love how many, like, unique visual synergies there are with C-section. Uh, only bad thing is that now we don't have... Oh, we do have a creep thing. There we go. I'm a creep. <laughs> okay. So let's just... But I don't have a stone poop, and we, you really want a stone poop if you're doing the creep and holy poop thing. So I think I'm just gonna... I mean, we have C-section now. We can save the holy poop for next floor. We can even just end up saving it for Ultra Greed. Because now C-section can carry me through the entire game. Addicted. Oh, that's actually really bad in this mode. Shit. Because that only, that effect only lasts for the room, the current room, but uh, in greed mode, you stay in the same room for a while. Look at these poops. Why are you giving me so many flaming poops? This is just like Taco Bell. <laughs> I like the little dude circling there. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just uh, smear that on the ground. I mean, we already have homing shots, so the, the holy poop barely matters at this point. It'll just make us ludicrously OP. I really like this custom sloth with the, uh, the cordyceps fungus grown out of his face. <laughs> oh my god, another one. It reminds me of, uh... In college, I drew, like, a self-portrait for my design class. And it, I had, like, a mushroom growing out of my eye. And, like, a couple other, like, weird gross things. Like, there was, like, a patch missing from my hair and stuff like that. And, uh... And my art teacher was like, Gross! Change it! <laughs> I'll never forget those immortal words. That amazing advice. So you may be wondering... 
why I am not picking up anything. And that is because I am going to, I'm going to try the funny penny strat. Uh... Okay. That's cool. And I think... I just, I, I just gotta think here for a second. <laughs> cool. Very cool. Alright. Uh, we have so much to work with here. Let me just wrap it up over there. Tons of stink. Oh! God, that would be so fucked to use in greed mode. <laughs> I'm like wondering if it could possibly be used to a, to a benefit, but I, I don't, I don't really think it could. And even if it could, it would just be so annoying that I, I wouldn't even want to. Okay, uh, yeah, let's not. I mean, it could be funny, could be funny. Okay, speaking of funny, we are going to use the funny penny. Well, at least we got a coin out of it. This is not a move I would have done if I did not have an amazing build already. Uh... Hmm... Do we have... We don't even really have a way to charge this at the moment. Okay. Don't even have a key, so let's just... Thank you. There you go. <sighs> this is more exciting than Mysterious Paper. Mysterious Paper is just kind of boring. And... Hmm, let's just think here. Uh... No, I think we're just gonna hold on to this. Screw this gold chest. We'll just use the key for next floor. Still got enough to populate our poop pile. And I can't get any of these items because uh, I'm bad. But Crooked Penny actually can be pretty good in greed mode because you can just dupe the entire shop. And frankly, that's what I should have gone for. But we had to go for the funny. Okay. Oh. This has, like, a specific thing with C-section, doesn't it? Yeah. That's cool. Okay, second syringe of the run. You know what? I'm gonna try to dupe that to get spun. Big brain play. Uh, oh look! There's the shopkeeper that's literally a grapefruit reference. Moldy bread poggers. Hello, friends. I have to be careful here, because I don't want to accidentally re-roll. Wouldn't be the end of the world, these are not great items, but... You don't want to blow up the restock machine if you can help it. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be- this is gonna get pretty goofy. This is the time. This is the floor to use this. We're gonna set up camp, and I'm not gonna leave the room like an idiot this time. Okay, just smear that all over there. Uh, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna go up here. And, and then we're going to take out the holy poop. It is, it does in fact have the aura. And then we're just gonna, I'm just gonna toss that like right there. And now, my friends, we have damage. Oh. Oh. Oh yes. Oh yes. The thing is, if even one of those comes near that stone poop, it's just gonna go bye-bye. But now, my friends, you see the power of Tainted Blue Baby. This is not a bad character, this is a great character. Sadly, I can't be optimal with the, like, charges of the, the funny penny. Oh god, uh, no, uh, hold on. Before that gets broken, pick up a bunch of poops. It's- it's right on the verge of breaking. 
Uh, we're just gonna fire, fire, ow. Uh. God, I'm like panicking. Ah, I am hardcore panicking. Wow, there's so many bombs. Can a, can a guy get a stone poop here? Apparently not. Okay. Uh, sad. Like, why are there so many bombs? Look at this. You, like, this is normally... This is not your typical... Tainted Bluebab fair. Okay. It's, uh, explosive diarrhea is this one, by the way. It's just like the pill. Okay, there's two stone poops. Finally. Uh, let's, let's just use both of them. Screw it. Okay. I just want to, like, meme on these bosses, is all. Come on over here, bro. Okay, come on over here, bro. There you go. Okay, he's just sitting on the holy poop and it's destroying him. Goodbye. <laughs> <gasps> worth it? I'm gonna say worth it. Oh god, uh... This should be interesting. Uh, uh, how did none of those hit me? Okay. <laughs> and right in time, it's gone. Okay. Well, that was humorous. Time to duplicate Godhead? Time to duplicate Godhead. One penny. Goodbye. It doesn't even benefit. Actually, no, it does. Hmm. We don't have secret room. These do explode on contact, I think. No, I need to like space it out. if these give me anything. It's so weird. What a kooky build. Hey, there you go. Alright. Now, time to check for secret rooms. I guess we can just check them all for free. And I do not have funny penny charge. Cool. Now I know the exact spot to stand to check in this room. <laughs> oh no, I'm wasting these poops. Okay, you know I really hate to do this, moldy bread guy. You know I think you're poggers. But, uh, it must be done. Okay, it must be... in the curse room or down below. Okay, uh, uh, hmm. Let me just... Like, I think I already bombed this room enough to check there, but... Just double check. Uh, yes, I am hilarious. So I'm gonna go in here. I'm gonna say that was worth it, golden pill. Shot speed up. Shot speed up's actually pretty cool. Accidentally gulped or accidentally put that poop in the jar, or whatever. Who cares? <clears throat> there you go. Okay. Uh, these are both gonna get popped. Just, just instantly. And now we have the funny pill. We could even try to dupe the funny pill. Uh, which, I, I don't know, it could get rid of the goofy pill, that's the only, that's the only thing. Also, these are shot speed up, that's a shot speed up pill. Hold on, I gotta blow my nose.
Oh, excuse me, folks. You didn't miss anything. Uh... Hmm... I don't really- there's nothing else we can really do on this floor. But are these bigger now? They are bigger because of the goddamn mush. Okay, let's just pick up the speed ball, because I am actually pretty slow. And shot speed is nice because I want these things away from me. Okay. Yeah, this is some pretty intense damage we got going on here. I'm not- I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Alright. Alright. Uh, gotta be careful here. Cause when it hits the fire, it does indeed blow up. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, give me a little bit more damage. Get me off the funny number. Now we got batteries for days, but sadly I can only, you know, fail, oh, fail Crooked Penny once and then all the batteries go away. Kinda lame. Blood Rites is really, really bad for this character too, so let's try to get that double speed, baby. Wow. Yeah, we have not gotten a single successful dupe this run. Okay. This will be the moment that determines if I am a true man of comedy or not. I'm excited, baby! Oh god, oh god. Oh no. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Speed down. Foggers. Drowsy. And and it undrowsied because I think I'm excited instantly procked again. I think that's what just happened. <laughs> gulp, gulp the double damage, or the, the, the two damage. Mm. Uh. T time for that enemy to die. Time to die, bro. There you go. Hey, look, funny penny procked. It actually did something. In the in the in the brief moments before my life is ended. This shop has nothing in it. Let's just get rid of all those I'm excited procs. <laughs> okay. Well, the goal of having a funny run has been achieved. Health up. <clears throat> Let's just keep doing this. <laughs> Another speed down. Oh, I should have picked up. Actually, do we... no, there wasn't even another trinket. Let me use it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh god. No, no, no! <laughs> well, you know what? I had perks, so it only did half a heart. That's something. Unfortunate luck there. Health down! God damn it, I had just... Actually, you know, in the end, the perks actually hurt me. Because if I had had one half a heart less there, it would have... That health down would have turned into a health up. Health up. Stompy. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Health down. Okay. <laughs> this is actually somehow a scary room. Oh, did they not blow up? Okay. Did blow up on that. Uh, okay. Look at that. Brilliant. Now. Health up. 
Let's see how many times we can keep this going. All God damn it. Uh, you know, I'm tempted to not take the speed down pills. I know people are going to object. People are going to cry about this. Oh, okay, it's it's over. It's finally over. Okay, uh <laughs> Jesus. There is a that is a that is one huge pile of shit. Okay. Let's just set up shop in here. And Let's think what I want to uh, I mean, ideally, we want to use all these poops to get a really good build for Ultra Greed. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna burn through them. Burn, you say. Alright, uh, one, two, three. Four, five, seven, eight, nine. I'm gonna use that. The black poops are like really rare, but they don't really do much. Like I know they have like a Necronomicon effect upon clearing a room, but I don't know. It just doesn't doesn't wow me. I'm gonna temporarily put that in there. Blah blah blah. We have so goddamn many. such a shame that it was unavoidable to do all this, too. Like, there was no... There was no other option in this run than to do the funny. Okay... It's gonna blow up. Uh... Oh, that was just that right. Uh, it's not looking like we're really gonna get like a good, a good build here. I was really hoping for a holy poop to show up. The fact that we're stompy actually is probably gonna be a detriment too, because I'm just gonna end up stomping that holy poop that we just got. Okay, uh, I'm gonna continue to cycle through just for a little bit longer. Okay, we have creep poops there, so I'm going to use the one in my hold jar. And I'm going to put the holy poop in the hold jar. Just so we can get... That, that's a good setup right there. Now... Uh... This... That's bad. We can at least maybe still get something out of this shop. We still have the shop floor. I think I mistakenly said that this was the last shop. <laughs> we do have quite a bit of money. Uh, oh, we don't. I don't even. I haven't even killed the boss yet. Hmm. Ever. You really gotta be careful with this build. Not to accidentally walk into your own slow moving Ipecac babies. Sequel to Muppet Babies. Slow moving Ipecac babies. Uh, okay. <laughs> what a wacky build. It would have been nicer with Godhead, but whatever. What can you do? Not use Funny Penny on it? <laughs> Stupid. Oh, right, that gives you soul hearts, too. Really, that hurt me? I tried to do it ever so gingerly. Okay. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> At least that one didn't matter. Uh... Let's do it. Let's go in here now. Oh! <laughs> it's useless, actually, because I don't think it will do anything to me. Specifically red hearts. Let's take it because it's funny. Uh, 
Uh, no, that's blood rights or whatever. Yeah, we're just gonna leave. Time to die in this room. If this room had, like, some spiders in it, it actually would have been really scary because I'm at risk of blowing myself up. This is really the ultimate tainted blue baby run because constant risk of blowing yourself up accidentally. Breakfast, it's fine. It's one hit. It's just, uh... You know, weren't we just... Didn't we already do Sheol? Or was that last run that I'm thinking of? I must have been thinking of last run. Oh, yeah. That's... that's what we want. Now, I know what you're thinking. Just pick it up, right? There's a soul heart to buy there, there's jammies, but... I'm thinking we try to use the funny penny on it. Because it could... it could give us more soul hearts, guys. I could get more. It could be free! You guys know. You guys know what I'm talking about. Okay. Uh... I am gonna- I'm gonna buy a soul heart, though, because I'm scared. Okay. That's pretty nice, actually. Uh, alright. Uh, should I... Yeah, let's at least... Smear one line of creep. And, you know, I think when it's all broken up like that, it actually will not work with, like, the continuous, like, effects. Which is a little lame, I think. Uh, so, I'm just gonna leave it at that. I, I was thinking about smearing another one, but whatever, who cares. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> It's like, normally you want the holy poop creep just to get the homing shots, but now we just have homing shots. Oh, oh! That host is a real piece of shit, there we go. This beam does so much goddamn damage, too. In fact, the, the creep barely does anything without the holy poop at this point. So I don't even care about keeping the creep. Oh, never mind. I was trying to take that without hitting the button, but whatever. That guy has like no health, so. Now he literally has no health. So yeah, streams that will be upcoming. I think Bella and I will do something for sure. Not exactly sure what yet, but uh, we will we will be doing some stuff. Uh I'm gonna do another Diblob stream, Diblob 2, I I just haven't got around to doing that. We're, we're gonna do the Funny Penny. The Funny Penny paid off! Funny Pater deniers and haters in shambles right now. In absolute tears over this development. Um... Finally, it had to proc eventually. No, it didn't. It's actually a lie. And now we're just gonna reroll until we find something real good, but that uh, we might not find something real good. Hey, remember when I was one hit away from death? Ooh, we could charge the funny penny! Okay, we got deep pockets. There's the guppy trinket, that's kinda cool. Uh, I mean, if I was trying to donate to the greed machine, I would just, of course, just go. I would've stopped trying to buy things a long time ago. Might as well just grab that. Get deep pockets. Get that. Whatever. Peach D. Give me another golden pill. Hmm. It would have been funny. <laughs> wow, that bone heart actually replaces? Okay. It's just straight up a detriment. Whatever. In fact, I'm just gonna get rid of this bone heart. Screw it. Telepills are now null and void. Uh, 
funny penny. Okay. Well, there it goes. Uh, how many poops have we got sitting around here? Let's let's schmear. I'm gonna throw a bomb and then spawn in the boss. Okay, the boss was nowhere near the bomb. Very cool. In fact, there were four bosses and none of them were near. Uh, uh, yeah, we, I mean, we, we get this. Naturally. <laughs> just hear them exploding in the distance. I did that just so I wouldn't take contact damage from this guy. It's useless, but whatever. Uh, I'm gonna just... Uh, yeah. Cause I, I want I want a stone poop going into the Ultra Greed fight. And we currently don't have one. Let sausage. The best part about that sausage channel is that some of the sausages actually turn out really well. Like the Vegemite sausage, he was like, this is a huge upset. It's actually amazing. <laughs> Even though Vegemite is one of the most, like, fucking spiteful, hateful substances on the planet. Whoa. Why was that so weird? Why are there so many explosions there? I actually kind of don't get what just happened. Uh, alright. We got a stone poop. We got creep. We got holy poop. Let's just go. Now, I, in fact, I think we still have the shop, too. I keep forgetting how this works. So really, that was kind of pointless. Whatever, let's just, like, blast through this floor. The angelic prism is really cool. Okay. I mean, I, I don't need to be... We don't need to actually try to do well here. Oh! Should I just, like, spam the funny penny? God, those rainbow explosions look so cool. <laughs> Ooh, ha, 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 ha. Yeah, whatever. Get a new shtick. Am I mental, or did I just pass directly through one of those, like, crag ground explosion things? God, I can shoot an Ipecac baby and then, like, chase it down with the prism and just turn it into four rainbow babies. That's really cool, actually. Yeah, I don't even need the creep. It honestly doesn't do much at this point. Okay. I mean, as usual, with runs where you're not actually trying to unlock anything, the goal is just to, like, humiliate the final boss as hard as possible. I'm gonna pick up a 15th coin and then learn sausage. <laughs> okay. Goodbye, goodbye. Uh, Glyph of Balance. No. Even though that's plus two soul hearts, we want Purgatory. And. Hmm. Let's just get that. Boring, I know. We have a stone poop, we have... We do not have a creep poop, though. Hmm. Ow, fuck. Why was that so delayed? Okay. Let's just... Boop. Bop. 
It's actually easier to just leave the room there because the spiders are so difficult to deal with. Okay, we got a stone poop. No creep poop, though. Why? Why? Well, hmm. Could just try, let's, first things first, let's re-roll. Okay. <laughs> oh, you know, is the beam, the beam is exploding. That's what's going on. The beam from Revelation when you have Ipecac, and I think we've seen that exact interaction before, too. It, like, has an explosion in it when it hits enemies. Look up. We do get free secret rooms here. Whoa. That's just so cool. Let's chase them down. I just made them slower. Okay. <laughs> Look at that fucking one. The Calvin pissing bumper sticker. What the fuck? What a bad reference. What a bad reference. Why is that even, like, what is up with the Calvin pissing sticker anyway? Didn't, like, uh, J James Watterson or whoever, the guy who made Calvin and Hobbes, said he, like, didn't like it, right? He was, like, not a fan. I think I remember hearing that. That he was like, literally, why? Okay. Well, we do not have an ideal thing going on here, frankly. Just try to set up, set up poops there. Whoa, that launched me. I just need a creep poop, that's all. Another holy poop, you're kidding me. You've gotta be shitting me. Okay, I don't even, oh no, I see a creep in there. Okay, whatever, let's just shoot some things, get the, get some poops. Okay, the creep is acquired. Now we're gonna... Oh god, oh god. Toss that there. Toss that there. Oh god, uh... No, we lost it. God damn it. Okay, whatever. Goodbye, Ultra Greed. It was nice knowing you. Well, he's over here, he's safe, because he's hiding... Hiding in the shadow of the holy poop. Okay, now we got two stone poops. Two! Three! Holy shit. Goodbye! 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 <laughs> goodbye! <laughs> goodbye! It's actually not, like, doing that much damage to him. Like, I thought explosions cut through, uh... Cut through armor. Oh, he- he hates it! Oh, he wants that holy poop dead! He wants it dead! <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's enough of that. We had our fun. It was not ideal. He literally, he like zeroed in on it and was like, I'm, I'm getting rid of that. Oh, and now we can just like spam Poopa Stinkas at him. There, there is, uh, there's not really a conceivable way that he wins this. Except if I tell a pills. In fact, I'll tell you what. If I get a better setup going into it, I will telepills. Oh, no, he died. He died unintentionally before I could stop it. Okay. Okay. Good. Good run. Solid run. Could have had Godhead, though. <laughs> so anyway, uh, yeah, that's my tutorial on how to play Poopastinka. Uh, <laughs> hope you learned a lot. Just be really lucky and get all the best items in the game. And then throw them away. 
All right, boys and girls, I'm going to leave. Uh, you can expect in the coming days, like I said, uh, some dip blob, something with Bella probably, uh, and what was the other thing? Like more Isaac. Do I even have any other ongoing games right now? I think I have one other. Let me look at the list. This is why I have the list. Uh, I guess Katana Zero. I might fuck around with Katana Zero a little more. Although I did technically finish the game, so I'm gonna mark that as finished. Uh, but yeah, I mean, fun runs. Actually got a decent score on the daily, too. Like, a decent ranking, which is, uh, unusual. I'll have to remember to add this to the tally. We're getting kind of close. How many, how many dailies have I done? Um... I, I think we're on like 20, 21. Yeah, that, that was the 21st there. So we have 10 more dailies to do. Which, uh... Seems like a lot, and that's because it is. Because <laughs> they make you do 31 goddamn dailies, and I will never forgive them for that. Uh, but I hope you got a kick out of this. Should we go raid someone? Let's see who's live. Lark was streaming Death Stranding earlier. Uh, oh my god! Mike is watching Ordinary Sausage right now! What? What a coincidence. Okay. Well, guys... You gotta go to Mike's channel. Raid... Like, what the fuck? He's literally watching the thing I was talking about. Uh, go raid... Jabroni Mike, and, uh... And, and I want you guys to spam the words Let's, let's Sausage in the chat, in all caps. I think it would be really funny. Okay, guys, you take it easy.